topping the skinny this morning, Beyonce and Jay-Z's date night. Well, sort of. Queen Bee headlined Budweiser's Made in America Festival in Philly on Saturday. That's their version of a date night. Her <laughs> rapper husband curated the two-day event, inviting 60 artists and bands to perform. Beyonce's performance, of course, was a knockout spectacle. The uh. crowd thrilled. Look at all those outfits, including her number one fan. That's Jay-Z himself hiding under the heavy gray hoodie, grooving incognito to Beyonce's one plus one. One heck of a night out for the pop music power couple. And you know, he's always very vocal about being a fan of hers, yeah. and respecting her as an artist and as a performer. Um, so this is just more proof of that. And of course, so Beyonce's cute. birthday September It's B-Day. It was a national holiday, I think, it, wasn't it? It was so a national the holiday. Holiday before, before Labor Day. Exactly. <laughs> B-Day. Well, two celebrity homes in the news this morning. 70s heartthrob David Cassidy selling his home in Fort La Lauderdale after declaring bankruptcy. The Partridge Family star listing the 64 100 square foot mansion for $3.2 million. Wow. It features six bedrooms, a pool, and a boat dock. It goes up for auction on Wednesday. Oh, that's too bad to see that go. Rapper 50 Cent, meanwhile, is trying to sell his $8 million mansion in Connecticut to settle his bankruptcy debt. But it's this house making news. Fitty posting this Instagram video calling it his crib in Africa and promising the craziest housewarming party ever, but no word on where in Africa it might be. There's something fishy about this. That is weird. Well, who posts this video when they're going through bankruptcy proceedings? Exactly. And with all the money he's making with power yeah, on I stars. Know. But I, I don't want to question Fitty publicly because, you know, yeah. it's kind of intimidating. Right. <laughs> <laughs> the week-long Burning Man Festival ends this morning. 70,000 people are heading home from that experiment in community and art. The tents were erected across six square miles of the Nevada desert. Well, they're coming down. And so is the unusual artwork erected on the spot. Highlight Saturday's burning of a wooden effigy of the man. Actress Susan Sarandon returning this year to scatter the ashes of her friend Timothy Leary, the guru of psychedelia, and uh, singer Katy Perry, a first time burner, posting this video of her trying to ride a Segway despite the desert wind. Strange images all over Burning Man this week. Which is not so strange for Burning Man. Exactly, they just call it Monday. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> all right, also in the skinny, R&B artist Erica Badu. This song, On and On, there it is, probably one of her most well-known. Um, big fan, but she's also famous for her unique sense of style, which, Candice, you saw firsthand. Yeah, I was on a flight from uh, L.A. to Dallas and ran into this this interesting coat on uh, as I was getting off the flight. Take a look, and if you look close up, it says, you know, type to ask celebs for selfies. And, of course, I am. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm like, hey, Erica, would you mind taking a selfie? So she grabbed my phone, and after the fact, I noticed she clicked a couple of selfies of her own there on the phone. That's and then funny. we took a couple other photos there together. That's that's uh, great. Love that piercing. I have and to wonder if she wears the coat as a deterrent so people will not ask her, or as an invitation. Well, she was very, very kind about it. So she was like, "Yeah, sure." That's so. Great. I think I it's that. probably somebody will ask her. She goes, "You know," and, and this is truthful here. She says, "Yeah, you can you can take a picture with me." Okay. Hold on, but you can't use my phone. Uh, wait for it. All right, we'll be back. <laughs>